All right, well, it's tournament day. Got a couple people already started. I'm heading down to start. Uh, didn't have very many people show up this time. It's one of the smaller tournaments, turnouts. But uh, it's all right. I'm going to get started over here. Right, I got a game plan. I'm going small baits. And I'm going to hit these places that I know. Oh, he's already on the board. He's got a nice one. Pete down there. That's good. At least we'll have a winner for sure. Didn't take him very long at all. There we go. Come on. Smallest hook I have, and I'm not getting a hook set on it. There we go. Got one. He's not coming off. Decent little quad. Good as in I caught him. That's what I mean by a good one. Ow, ow. Let me get up somewhere where I can take a picture of him where he can't get away. Up in these rocks over here. Nine inches. Now I gotta get him released. All right, this is exactly what I thought was gonna be the money bait today. It's a little three and a half inch grub from American Tackle. That's, I knew that's what I would be catching him on if I caught him. So far, that's what I got it on. I'm trying to get up into these trees and bushes right over here. Oh, come on, there, there's definitely something there. Had a couple of bites on it. All right, I had to take a bit of a break there because we're in triple digit temperatures today. Had to go get some water. Uh, but I'm back at it. We still got about two hours to go. Only an hour in. I'm gonna try under this bridge in the shade for a while, so maybe the fish are Maybe some of the bigger spotted bass and largemouth are stacking up under the bridge in the shade. The guads are out in the fast moving water. They're usually pretty aggressive too, so. But that's what that's what I've already got. I think that's what uh, Peter caught earlier, Pete. But yeah. At least we got a couple of fish on the board. Somebody will take home the money. Pretty sure Peter's was bigger than mine. Mine was only nine inches, and from but I was, was kind of far away from him when he caught his. But his must have been close to twelve. But we'll find out. Oh no 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 no! Come on, straighten the hook. Straighten the hook, please. got something kind of a secret weapon here since I ran out of my little jig heads uh, I've still got some of those grubs so, but I'm gonna have to put them on a bigger jig head but I got this these little tiny crankbaits they're sinking crankbaits so I got to use them kind of like a little rattle trap but that's all right I think they rattle and they're just the right size for this river Take it. Go ahead and take it. Getting all kinds of stuff following it over here. That's good. That, that was not good.
Yeah, actually, I have. Chris? Yeah. What's up? If you're going to talk about somebody, you probably shouldn't say it where they can hear you. I just spotted one. I can actually see one that looks like a decent one and then a couple other fish around it. I'm trying to bring this over where they're at. It looks like they're getting on top of this rock in the current and trying to feed on what comes through there. But I lost where the bigger one went. Got him. Got him. It's not a very big one, but it's better than the one I got earlier. No, it's not better. I thought it was. From so far away, they look bigger. It's weird. Ooh. That one's hooked through the eye. Don't want to do this, especially in a tournament, but I'm gonna have to cut the barb. so I can release him with minimal damage. There we go. It's probably gonna be blind in that eye, but it's part of the game. It's another nine inch bass. Let's let me go. Swam off fine. It's unfortunate, but I tried to minimize the damage. And I think there's more over there too, so I'm gonna keep fishing that same spot. Oh my god, look at that. Forget about the tournament for a second. Let me get something. There is a big catfish right there. Oh, he knows it too. He's turned. Ooh. Coming up, coming up into the last half hour. Oh, got him, got him, got him, got him, got him. Don't come off. Yes. Same size as the other two, but I got one. Got him. This will put me up. At 27 inches, I think. There we go. There we go. There we go. <laughs> Number four, five. Actually, it would have been seven, but what if fucking got off on the rocks? Yeah, there's a big ass catfish up here too. Nice yeah, it's better than the other ones. So, looks like Greg's in the lead now. Unless, I don't know how uh, Ray over there is doing. Yeah. Hmm? I had one on. It had to be at least uh, 15 inches. Yeah, this... sort of, it was heavy. I was like, oh man, I fucking cut the rock right. <laughs> and then it came up and jumped and threw the hook. Yeah. Like, that was a big We're in the last 15 minutes here. I got four. Biggest one is about 10 and a half inches. Hmm. 
<laughs> Good night on that. Which one is it? Yeah, the other one with the. Uh, eight and a half. You can go a little bit because it's like right at the eight inch mark, but if you look at it, the lip is sticking out past the end of the ruler. So I can give you another half inch there. Ray got skunked. It's the first time, the, I think that's the first time he hasn't caught anything. Yeah, he's been he's been the most consistent. He won the last tournament, yeah, right? I remember that. He's, you've been the most consistent out of everybody in the <laughs> in the club. Let's see. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> My first time actually fishing and I caught something. <laughs> Yeah, the uh, the tournament in May, we had somebody who's never been freshwater freshwater fishing before, and he came in third place with the, with uh, caught a five pounder. Oh, there are two that were up there, some big ones. I was like, that time I move the location and I put it. <laughs> what do you got, Greg? Right. Yeah. It's right at nine. Mm -hmm. Ten. Ooh, uh, eight. Uh -huh. Well, it's at eight oh, and a half there, yeah. but you're but you're you're a half inch off there. Scoot over a half inch, and you got an eight. Yeah, they flop around a lot. Yeah, he's lined up there, but I can give you like a half. You can get like another. I can get you up to an eight there. And the last one. That was what, like a six? Oh no, that's an eight too. Just try eight. Do seven and a half. I got the big fish finally. I got ten and a half. Yeah, but it's dink fest, dude. Yeah, it was dink fest. Not big fish. <laughs> and and before the tournament greg was saying we should skim the winnings and give some to the second place winner so oh, i said he forgot the second place prize this time i didn't forget it i just didn't have time to put one together <laughs> all right well i'll add up the totals and stuff later and get the website up later website updated and all that that's a giant fake check i owe you like what I owe you. Thanks for coming out, guys. Thanks, man. I appreciate when you host you, man. I appreciate when you guys actually show up. Thank you. Come out to the next one. Are you on Facebook or anything? Or? Um, I'm on Facebook. I'm actually in California. Oh, well, you can join the group anyway. Oh, really? Show Absolutely. some of those California bass. There's the big ones over there. Yeah. That's where they do the glide bait fishing that nobody can get the hang of anywhere else. Those big swim baits. Yeah, you can't catch them with those here. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, well, I appreciate you doing all this, man. It's, it's fun. I, yes. I, I thought it was a lot more people. Yeah, there was a lot more people said they were coming and yeah. didn't show up. So. Yeah, there was a lot of people who said they were coming. Yeah, but we got, I think we got a good core group that shows up usually. So yeah. We usually have at least 10. This is this is the smaller the group. smallest tournament yeah. we've had since since I started it. The very first tournament had like five people show up. And that, there was nobody in the club then.